Uh, hello from New Jersey. Uh, I'm going to show you uh, my car brought a very good example of uh, how things can be done in uh, in real world. Uh, I had a problem. Uh, I had misfire uh, in my uh, car. Uh, engine was uh, misfiring, which means car was not shaking pretty badly, but uh, you could hear when a uh, car was on uh, you know on park for example or on neutral that uh, it was uh, engine was not working properly uh, so i opened the hood and uh, this is what i found well i didn't find uh, 250 dollars but uh, i found them by fixing problem myself uh, what was the problem uh, over here Mm, you see a lot of uh, hoses and uh, some kind of small parts and uh, I heard some kind of uh, hissing noise from from this area uh, I'm not mechanic but I tried to figure out what was wrong and I was able to uh, pinpoint problem it was this part it's like two small uh, plastic uh, halves which uh, connected together and they uh, installed uh, with uh, uh, clamps right those two parts they came uh, you know apart from from each other and engine was uh, pouring uh, air uh, instead of uh, you know air air was supposed to go through uh, through the system and it was going into the uh, air so um, i looked up uh, internet and uh, this is what i found uh, this part is uh, uh, it's cost about 75 bucks 75 dollars uh, it would cost about it would take about an hour to uh, change it at uh, dealership and on top of that, uh, they probably would ask you for, uh, they would ask uh, to make uh, diagnostics on your car. Because at this moment, uh, when you have problem with this part, uh, you would have a check engine light on your dashboard. Diagnostics, 90 bucks, part 75 bucks, and one hour of labor, about 100 bucks. So total, those uh, 250 50 bucks which I showed you uh, I decided uh, to try uh, I decided try to fix uh, this problem myself uh, I went to a, a junkyard uh, its place where you, know, you have uh, old cars uh, cars which uh, gonna be crashed uh, and where you can buy used parts from I found uh, this part at that uh, junkyard uh, it cost me five dollars i replaced that that part by myself uh, and instead of paying 250 dollars i paid just five dollars the only problem was in this case um, it took me uh, three hours uh, because of uh, original clamps uh, those things i was thinking that i would be able to grab them with uh, pliers or with knife or with uh, uh, screwdriver and remove uh, the part uh, but i wasn't able i i fought for like three hours uh, but again other than that uh, everything went pretty pretty nice pretty smooth uh, this part which i bought this one as you can see i was hoping that uh, someone uh, uh, i was hoping that um, car which i would find at uh, junkyard uh, have this part already replaced and that mechanics used uh, clamps with uh, screws and it, it happened indeed so it was pretty easy for me to obtain this uh, part um, and replace it so uh, in three hours and five dollars i paid for this part used parts uh, five dollars a junkyard i was able to finish a job and uh, it saved me roughly 250 bucks so if you have some uh, any problem with your car try to figure out what it is and maybe fix it yourself it may be 
uh, a lot cheaper than if you would bring your car to a dealership. Alright, that's it for now. Bye.